All right, Scott, you ready to wait? Ready, set, wait game? Ready, set, wait. Let's go have some nice, nice sit down. Nice Lots dinner of, and nice beer. Yeah. Fill our heads with liquor. Yeah. Here's another trip. All right, so we made it to Denver International Airport. Bad news is, is our flight got delayed by about 40 minutes, so making the late flight even later. Got to work with what we got, but it definitely makes it a little inconvenient because we had to get a new rental car. The agency we went with in Sacramento actually closes about 30 minutes uh, after our flight would have landed, so that's pushing it almost way too close. So it's just about 1.30 here. We just landed in Sacramento. We're in line to get the uh, rental car right now, so that way we can drive over to UC Davis, which what I've been told and what I've looked at on maps is probably about a 30 to 40 minute drive. So night is almost over. Let's go. Made it here to the hotel almost 2 a.m. ready to go to bed to get all set up tomorrow morning. Day one in Davis. We're in Davis, right? Davis, California. Davis, California. Heading over to UC Davis to set up for the water polo games and then the counterattack show. So we got our sweet SUV right here. Guys, ready for game one? This one is Kazakhstan and China. So, ready to go. How's being a camera up? A little warm, but I heard it was way warmer earlier this week, like in the 90s. So, I'm pretty sure we've gotten lucky. I, we brought the great weather from Colorado. So for this game, we're incorporating something new that we've never done before, which is an underwater camera. We actually got two of them for this tournament, um, which are actually pretty cool cameras for a Marshall. So I'll try and get a better shot of them, but I have it underwater on the edge of the pool right now. Uh, trying to see if we can get it behind the goals on one of the games here. We'll see. Scott. We'll get some work to do, but I think we'll uh, iron it out tomorrow. Awesome. Finished up the last game for today. I think we're going to go somehow celebrate Cinco de Mayo. So good ending to the night. And then back at it again tomorrow. Luckily, we get the whole morning off. So it'll be a good one. Any thoughts, Scott? Sleep in. Oh, wait. Corona sleep in. Do <laughs> waterfall. Liquor first yes all right on to tomorrow day two 
All right, guys, so we're back for day two. Another three games today. We're ready for game two, which is Kazakhstan and Canada, and then followed up by USA tonight against, I believe, Australia. Is that the last one that hasn't played tonight? Yes, so that'll be a preview of the gold medal game, because that'll be tomorrow. They both have come into tonight's game undefeated, awesome. which qualifies them for the gold medal game tomorrow. So you're going to get a preview of the gold medal game tonight. Awesome. So it'll be nice, and then tomorrow morning. And uh, computers hold up great. Marshall cameras are working good. Uh, we repositioned them today. Watch so, the stream. Yeah, it'll be great. Check it out um, on Waterpolo's Facebook page as well as Waterpolo's YouTube channel, which is USAWP. I knew I could eventually get Scott directing. Try to pay the guy to do a job and all he does is do that. All right, final game of the night, Australia versus the United States. USA two for two. All right, guys, that is a wrap on day two. USA versus Australia. USA won in a final shootout, uh, nine to seven, which was pretty exciting because we don't experience a lot of shootouts with the regular water polo broadcasts. A lot of the times it's overtime, so it's pretty exciting to be able to film that. So end of day two, uh, tomorrow morning is the final medal rounds. So just three more games to go and we are all done with the 2017 FINA Women's Intercontinental Tournament. So we'll see you tomorrow. Alright guys, final day for the 2007 FINA Women's Intercontinental Tournament. Um, this time we get to do it in the morning. The games today are going to be the medal game, so it's, um, bronze, silver, and gold. The final game will be Australia and United States, just like we saw last night, so it should be exciting. The wind has picked up here, so it should make it a little bit interesting today, so we'll see how this game goes. Alright guys, so the final game of the day is over, USA versus Australia. Uh, Australia actually went to go and win the gold medal, so that's alright what happened, but we're ready for teardown now to everything headed home. So that's the end of a long weekend. One of the things I wanted to show you guys while we're tearing down is the additions we've done to the broadcast computer. One of the things we did is take out one of the top rows of the Black Magic capture cards and actually replace it with one of the Black Magic quad cards. What's cool about it is you can actually change through the Black Magic software which one or which SCI inputs are actually inputs or outputs. So now it gives us the possibility to actually have seven cameras in, which is what allowed us to do five cameras here. So the three main cameras that we always do, plus the HDMI camera from the clock, and then we added those two underwater cameras which are SDI. So something cool I just wanted to show you guys real quick while we were tearing down. Yes. 
All right, day is a wrap. Just finished all the teardown. Took us only about an hour to get everything packed up and we are ready to load that into the car and we are done with the day flying out to Denver tomorrow. Yeah.